future of I-81 in Syracuse will be a lot clearer 24 hours from now. A milestone step in the process is expected as the final design to replace the viaduct will be released. News Channel 9's Andrew Donovan joining us live in downtown Syracuse. Andrew, so explain it to everybody. What does this mean? What's the big hurdle about to be crossed? Well, Christy, this means that the federal government, the Federal Highway Administration, approves of the design developed by the State Department of Transportation and the process the state has followed to get to this point. It's a very technical process laid out in law, which is why it's taken years and so many milestones like this. We'll hear more about this final design tomorrow at a briefing scheduled by the State Department of Transportation. Senator Chuck Schumer confirms to News Channel 9 that a release of this document tomorrow will happen for some with wide formal publication on Friday. It's the final environmental impact statement, which will have some updates to the draft released last summer, including moving the roundabout from dear, near Dr. King Elementary to closer to the SU and ESF campuses and other tweaks based on public feedback. All of the comments from last summer's draft will be included with written responses in this new document. Senator Schumer writes to News Channel 9, quote, tomorrow we will have a final EIS. This summer, the ROD, Record of Decision, and then lots of J-O-B-S. Of course, he means jobs. He spells it out for us. This document's publication on Friday will trigger another formal public comment period. The DOT right now isn't scheduling anything nearly as complex as what happened last fall. All of those public meetings, all of those hearings, all of those open houses. Instead, as this project gets underway, the DOT will open an office in downtown Syracuse so people can actually talk with engineers and see the design in person themselves with their own eyes. Live in downtown Syracuse, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9. All right, Andrew, thank you. And when the final DEIS is released, we're going to be sure to post it for you at localesquire.com. That way you can read it yourself.